guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting really to episode 2 of Reborn as a Vending Machine. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Uh-oh, what happened? That's the... Excuse me? But you can. Oh yeah, we didn't get the opening last week. I can't take the bears seriously. Oh my god. That's the one thing. I don't expect it. I'm just like, hello. We're like, oh, okay. How you doing? Oh my god, a bear. Hello, Kuma. I feel like, but I shouldn't be surprised because Kuma, Kuma bear. So, y'all been on a journey for three fucking days. Hell no. Nah. You're like, mm. I mean, well, yeah, because, you know, it's from a place the shop will never go to. Oh, 
I know that voice. I heard his voice from. Oh my god. See, we're gonna have the whole episode trying to figure that out. Voice. Oh my god. Because all I'm thinking of is an asshole like character that I probably maybe liked or secretly hated. I mean, because she's obvious. <laughs> That's obvious. We know who that is. See, that makes me hungry. I haven't eaten yet. I just want food. I do have that freaking queso mac and cheese that I could make, but I got from Walmart. I'm sorry. <laughs> food. <laughs> I mean, you might as well let her fight. She can fight and hold her own. No. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but we can't see you in front of us. Oh, okay. Well, they're there. There you go. Like, damn, they, they decided, no, we're not going to give the frogs blood. So, you know, when they die... <laughs> Yeah. 
Now when I think about it more, he kind of sounds like Wealth, but no, that's not him. And then watch I look it up and I find out I'm right. Boxo. See, now I'm thinking Gilgamesh, but no, that kind of sounds fucking weird. <laughs> Wait, what? Gonna cheat. I need to know. I can't wait in the whole damn episode. No. Oh. How did I not figure it out when I? Oh. God, seriously? <laughs> I now know why I said, oh, I was like, asshole character. <laughs> yes, fucking Mondo, Danganronpa. I <laughs> I 
That's fine. Of course, he's going to try to steal the money. <laughs> I mean, that's a smart move, though. I would do it, too. Ooh. Well, of course it is. Oh my god. No, 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 no. I think she, yep, mm hmm. Hola? Are they supposed to be Mentos? <laughs> oh my god! Like, oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god.
It was easy. That was so good. <laughs> what the fuck does, he can change it to anything. <laughs> That's something I was not expecting today either, but the fact is that they were able to defeat the <laughs> You know, you never would have thought that in the end, the combination of soda, just cola, and Mentos, Wanted to feed a frog? <laughs> See, now here's a funny thing. What if, and I, I can't believe I'm about to say this. Okay, so you know that one, there's several, so many trends. Trends! That's the word I'm thinking of. Oh my god. What if they're stupid? <laughs> Let's say they use, um, you know, the trend with the watermelon uh, and the rubber bands, and they just, <laughs> and they use that. I mean, that would be a really good, like, explosion. And then, you know, you got watermelon chucks everywhere. That is a mess to clean up, but that could help in some way. Maybe. We just have to wait and see. But he can also transform into a jukebox. It's so cute. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> but okay, yeah. If you would have told me by this episode, if I had not watched episode one last week and decided to watch episode one and two this week, if you would have told me the fucking... <laughs> Kenya. Then you have fucking Kaede Hondo, psh, the queen, she's fucking queen, anything that she's in. Then you decide to get fucking Zoro from One Piece, and then you get darkness. <laughs> because, see, the thing was, in the opening, when I saw her character, I was just like, hmm, she could be voiced by anyone. Wouldn't it be funny if she's voiced by her? And then boom, you just hear it. You feel like, ma'am, I just saw you in the fucking Mega Me spinoff, and then here you are again. Making that appearance. Get your money. But it seems like her character, especially when you look at it in the opening, like she how how should we say this? And this is not like me being like not of mmm Yeah, I'll say offensive. Um Okay, so you know how, like, there is... Oh, okay, I'll use me as an example. Because I, I felt like there is so, some of my male audience, not all. I will say some. Um, there, There's always where it's, like, one girl who... Usually it is a girl who's, like, hella fucking popular and shit. And um, every guy, and I'm not going to say ever, Not all my freaking male guys... Uh, subscribers do this I will say it's like a little teeny tiny percent so I'll say like maybe what like five percent maybe between four and five percent mm -hmm. sent for you and it feels like the two who are with her kind of sent for her and that's only because like that gave me feels in the opening so it's just like okay she she might be like the bitchy character. But no, she seems really fun. And I really can't wait to see more episodes with her. But. <laughs> once again with the damn bear. The fucking bear. And just, you know, once again. Mentos and Coke saved the fucking day. Like. 
Who would have thought? And it just, once again, it makes me wonder, like, going into episodes three to the end of this show, like, what other trendy-ish are they going to do? Like I said, you know, the watermelon and the rubber band is one. Um, I don't know what the freak you could do with a jukebox, but, well, except play music, but I'm like, I haven't seen any weird trends with the jukebox. Like, it, it, anything that he's going to transform into it makes you instantly think of a different type of trend. But sometimes even with those other things that he can transform into, it possibly isn't for like a something that you've seen trending on Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, anything, hell even Twitter, or we can go very, very old on this, fucking Vine. But who really knows? <laughs> who really knows? But... Yeah, this is a damn good episode, but it's not expecting But okay, other than that, guys, that is our reaction to towards episode two of Reborn as a Vending Machine. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like, it really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. It's with my squad, and of course, I will see you guys officially all next Wednesday for episode three. Bye, guys!